Back home in Venezuela, strengthened by President Trump's support for her jailed husband. But as Lillian Tintori was greeted by supporters, the Venezuelan Supreme Court delivered a hammer blow, upholding the 14-year sentence given to opposition leader Leopoldo López. His wife remains determined to secure his release. I feel that the priority of the international politics of the White House is our country, Venezuela. They know all the details of what's going on in Venezuela. After meeting Tintori, Trump called for Lopez to be freed. The court ruling making his conviction final followed the next day. This amid rising tensions since the U.S. blacklisted Venezuela's vice president on accusations of drug trafficking. Lopez was jailed for leading anti-government protests in 2014, following a trial that one state prosecutor later called a mockery of justice. Opponents claim President Nicolas Maduro has become a dictator, but the socialist government supporters applaud measures like its decision to take CNN's Spanish language service off the airwaves in protest at its coverage.